Alright, it's uh, tournament day. Uh, uh, all week the weather's been great. You know, perfect conditions to be fishing. And then all of a sudden, overnight, last night, it just froze. So it dropped down to like 30 something, 30. And uh, so that's probably gonna make this tournament pretty tough. I mean, it's warmed back up. It feels like probably 65, 70 now. But uh, hopefully with it warming up, the fish will come back and be active. But I don't know, it's gonna be a really tough tournament. And uh, I'm out here a little bit early, just kind of scouting it out. I haven't been here in a long time. Hopefully there's some fish around here. It looks like chocolate milk. So this is gonna be a really tough tournament. And I think the whole lake looks like this. The water over here in this st stretch, looking at the camera here, it looks all right, but it's actually black. It looks like coffee but there is more clarity in it than there is anywhere else. So this might be a, my finishing point right here. Yeah, this right here, this is where I wanna finish it off. Around all this drown, this timber, and looks like there's some decent depth here. This is where I'm going to finish the tournament at. Not for the bank tournaments. Oh yeah, bank. <laughs> last time. Yeah. yeah, this is probably the highest pressured spot. What? I'm kind of waiting around because there should be one more guy coming up, but I don't know. I really want to get back like what he was saying. There's a deep hole over there on the back wall. That's, but the creek over here in this area is going to be where, well, there's a reason why everybody went this way. Really hope somebody catches a fish. We had a lot of people show up. It's one of our, one of our best turnouts for sure. Damn it, there's always somebody in my spot. No luck. I had one bite. Actually, even Jeff had a bite. Yeah. starting to think maybe the lake would be a little warmer yeah, than out here. Uh, I'm gonna keep going around this way and somebody was telling me there's a deep hole in the far left corner of the lake and that's probably where the fish are gonna be. But uh, There's uh, stretches of this creek though that are not chocolate milk. There, there's uh, some clarity to them. Oh, uh, Greg, I wasn't recording, so your fish doesn't count. Oh, come on. I had one. Oh, come on, damn it. Man, that was a good one too. Well, I mean, I was right about the uh, the coffee looking water over here being more productive than the uh, chocolate milk water. But uh, unfortunately, it wasn't productive for me. Somebody else landed one right in the spot where I was gonna be. So, we'll see what happens here. Anyway. Get some more here, somewhere else. God 
Got one. Got him. Come on. Thank you. How big was yours, Greg? Huh? It's a spotted bass, not a large mouth. I got one. Get that up there. Get me an 11 incher. Least catch him again. There we go. I'm thinking of uh, oh man, a big one just jumped right there. So I'm thinking about going back around this way and getting to the main lake. Yeah. Try this corner here real quick. see some like swirls and stuff out there so there's some little wakes so there's definitely fish in this area Anything? No? No? Did you catch anything? No, no, no. no. Let, let me see yours, Greg. <laughs> Do you have any luck? No? Um, I can see the tail better than that one. Just the one still, right? Yeah. I don't. I'll get <laughs> that shit off. There you go. About almost ten and a half. Almost. Yeah, ten and a half. And then we'll take a closer look at mine right now. Where's your name? They're like six inches. <laughs> I thought it was a little. <laughs> it's just a tiny little tail next to the seventeen. Right. <laughs> Why is it so dark? What's going on? I don't know. You got your phone on light? Oh, you brighten yeah. it up? Yeah, you get on there. 11. Right at 11. Damn it, boy. Beat him by half an inch. Damn. <laughs> but you still get 20 bucks out of it. <laughs> but, yeah. <laughs> well, thanks for coming out. <laughs> so, huh? Yeah, how big? 11, right at 11. And his was 10 and a half. So, but uh, yeah, I was hoping somebody would. But, uh, well, let's see. Did you catch anything? No. <laughs> I think next month we'll probably do the uh, Angler of the Year award too, which is most likely going to be Ray, <laughs> unless something crazy happens in, for next month's tournament. So, <laughs> but uh, yeah. <laughs> so, oh wait, let me write down my 11 on here. <laughs> Thanks for coming out, man. See you. I had an 11 and uh, Greg over here. Thank you. Had a 10 and a half. So. Hey, congrats on your record, 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. The San Antonio body of water record. Yeah, you know, See how long it stands through. though. <laughs> you know, like, like I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna make it. Like, don't worry, I'm gonna get it before you. <laughs> He's your cameraman and producer. <laughs> Yeah, I got to that damn spot and uh, I took two casts and boom. <laughs> hey, he goes down where there's only room for one person, so I'm off to the side clearing room to cast. And... Hey man, I see us stuck in there. Like, yeah. <laughs> so, hey, man, it wasn't anything we were throwing anyway. We were throwing the same thing. 